Hey guys, Blake here. Hey, I was uh, just wanting to shoot a little video uh, on just a couple things that I've noticed over the years. When you're setting up your solar panels on the roof of your van, one of the first things, this is the, the original panel that I removed. It's an Overland solar panel. Uh, all in all, a pretty decent panel. This is one of their first gens where they were putting the junction boxes up on the top. And you're seeing these actually failing probably a little prematurely than they should. I think this one is about four, four and a half years old. So when you're buying your panels, try to find solar panels if you have the room, if they're being installed on a rack, so you have the room underneath. Have the junction box underneath. I would say, uh, just like always, any time uh, we're able to keep these components out of the weather, uh, always the better. The next thing is all the cable jacks. Uh, so just a couple things on here is for one, it is completely okay uh, to make sure you actually give some slack, like leave the cords longer than right here. If you ever had to remove this guy and redo it, it's gonna make it really hard if there's no slack from the inside or the length of cable out here. Um, so it is okay to leave a foot or two or heck even three feet on those guys uh, and then it's going to actually give you more room to play with the panels up top without having to add an extra cable i always like to with any of the cable glands when i'm installing the panels like these are the new panels i installed these are a set of uh, 120 red arcs i love these panels uh, but you see what i had to work with on how to mount them i just used a couple cross braces on their U channel that they <laughs> screwed right to the flues there. Um, and they are sealed up um, from what I'm understanding. It's never leaked, but a sort of an interesting way of doing it. Um, it does work. But anyways, more of the point is where you can keep the cable glands actually underneath the panels. Again, this is a point that really it does not need to be exposed uh, to the elements. You have all the connections, you have the glands themselves. So let them be underneath the panels, let the panels absorb uh, all the things. So anyways, that's it guys. Uh, have a great day.